Welcome to Freako Plays God Mode Total War to Rome 2 Epirus Faction Episode 28. This is the Europe Campaign Part 10. This is the Battle of Rome. So, what we're doing here, our strategy is rather than zero in on Rome, no, we're just going right for it. We are going right for the heart of what's left of the Roman Empire. And just going for broke. But before we do that, we got everybody lined up. And I did make a couple things off of camera here. And we've got our first army there. That's me. That's my army. You notice we've got our we've got our six heavy onagers. And I have found I've had six set up with eight <coughs> eight heavy onagers already. You know, I don't think they're particularly needed. I think six is a better number. And this has still got, uh, we don't have as much cavalry, and I'm thinking about how to use my cavalry more effectively in God mode. There's the one unit that, uh, it does have a vulnerability. When you knock the dude off the horse, he doesn't get back on. And then, man, it just sucks. It just sucks. So, we're going to be thinking about that. We are, we're set to do a new change in our military soon we're gonna have to build a military pretty quickly and get stuff situated pretty quickly may have to build a, a fundamentally militia military because we don't want to have to take a turn <laughs> that's another matter these will be temporary militaries that are just going to be set up in places to uh kind of keep the peace because we've got a lot of uh factional folks out there so we got a lot of work ahead of us but right now, we have to deal with Rome. So we are going to... Oh, oh, the bad news. This is one of the reasons why we have to build our militaries. Because when we went through our purge... Well, I didn't command. realize if you kill the generals, it just takes out the whole mil army that they had. And unfortunately... There was five generals that had military, so I lost five gen five militaries. I should have ten. Instead, I have five. Actually, I'm able to have 14. Now, I'm going to be adding three new militaries, but all of these guys, there's going to be changes. It's going to be complex, but we are not going to deal with that until after we have conquered Italy. Once we have conquered Italy... Then we're going to deal with that new military reality as, as we want to we want to make sure that we have our empire consolidated and stabilized. And then we're going to, well, I'll show you here. Plan here is after Italy falls. What the heck? What the heck? What the heck? This isn't good. Oh, that's right. That's right, I never took this back. Hold on. Hold on. Let's see. Let's see where our units are. Where Where is this at? So let's go first to here. So there you are. So let's uh, see what unit is <coughs> nearest. No. So this is our first army. Wow, where's reserve two at? Okay, reserve two. Okay, reserve two. We're going to have to go take care of this real quick before we get this going. We have to go up on here. And we're going to have to deal with these insurgents. We can't have this on our watch. Just get on up here. Where are you at? Why are you not going? Wait a second. Where are you at? Oh, wait. Are you locked under siege? You can't move, can you? All right. So. Wow. So you can you move? Can you move? You can move. All right. Let's get on over to here then. I mean, why are you making this difficult for me? Folks, I did not plan this detour. So the Battle of Rome actually begins with, okay, I have to, oh wait, why are you still not moving? What the heck are you still not moving for now? 
Okay, so you are who I want to have highlighted. So now, why are you? Let's go. Let's go. Back, Cerberus, back. Come on. Poseidon, All right. Now. Okay, there we go. How about we do it like that? Yeah. I don't know why it wasn't moving. There you go. Yeah, you're going down. You're going down. Decisive victory. <clears throat> we can't have the, the this uh this continued secessionism. Ready for orders. All right. Let's see, did I get any of my military pension? Hmm. Where are you at, Cleon? Where are you at, Cleon? You're down here. Cleon is way down here. So I'm going to leave you there. Let's get back to MPS. Where are you at here? So what do we got going on here? You... Yeah, we're going to have to deal with this. We can't have this. Give me back my legions! Decisive victory. You know, I'm very happy I happened to do that switch with this reserve unit because they have... Uh, they have... They have the heavy guns with them, which really helps them right now with... What we're doing, with, what we're dealing with, asking you to break this uh, rebellion. So you got to be see, see, that's a little bonus. How about that? Before we even get to the Battle of Rome, I mean that is beautiful. Let's see if we got any other rebellions going on here. Yeah. Sometimes the couriers are, are late getting news to us, so we were unaware that we had that situation. But now, now we're going to... Okay, so let's, first off, let's make sure that we got you highlighted. Because we got to go down here and see, well, what's up with this? So let's go there. And let's, uh, okay. You know what? Let's go get you. Wait a second. No, 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 no. Hold on. I got somebody else here. Don't I have a... Uh, play on this right there. Just, uh... There you go. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> Putting you down. Putting you down. There you go. And we're going to, uh... Release the captives. Okay, so... Let's see if that has uh, has not gotten us any back of our army. So, but but let's see if we have crushed the rebellion. Let's keep you highlighted just in case on. we got anybody close by looking anywhere. Okay, so up 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 up. Okay, so we've got a situation here. Got got a guy up there. So let's see who we got uh, that we can deal with up here. So who's free? Admiral. Alrighty. Well, not you. Alright, I'm gonna have to get you. Dang it. Uh, dang it to, to Schmeckles. I hate to do this to you, buddy. I know you guys just hauled a piece, but uh, I'm gonna have to ask you to just go ahead and... Yeah. You got another guy there? What's up with that? Got a provincial capital? Uh, Alrighty. Alrighty there. So, so we're going to be heading this guy up here just to deal with this insurrectionist and put this, we got to quell the rebellion. This is what happens. This is the hard slogging that I do. And, and you get to see this. This is like bonus coverage. This is behind the scenes footage, the excitement, the drama and the all and the wonder. Oh, let me uh, make sure I got this highlighted so I can see where I'm coming from. All right, I can see where I'm coming from there and there. Just come on up. We're, we're almost here. We're almost here. You see that? You see that? You see that yellow? That yellow means I'm coming. There you go. You see me arriving. 
See, that didn't take long. We get here. We got our times and figures and numbers and facts. You see how we moving it? We booking it. We booking it. Ah, oh, yeah, baby. Just, just go punch him in the face. Just get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Just don't let them do this. Let's see. What do we got doing here? They got 1,400. We got 1,400. Listen. Listen. I tell you what. This might actually not end up being called the Battle of Rome. I'm going to actually change the title of this episode because this might be the end of the, uh, you know, we're going to fight this battle. We're doing this. We're doing this, folks. We're fighting this battle. So we're going to change the title of this episode. This is not going to be the Battle of Rome. No, no, no. No, no. Let's let's just get this uh let's just get this figured right here. We're going to call this uh, uh you know what? I tell you what. We are going to call this going to call this episode 28 part 10 putting putting down the Eporian Eporian rebellion. That's what we'll call this, putting down the Aburian Rebellion. So we're going to have to create a, another Rome episode. Don't worry. We'll deal with that. So I'm sorry. I fully intended on this being the Battle of Rome. But sometimes sometimes you got to go with the flow. When you realize the situation at hand, and let's see this unit up here. So we don't have any kind of uh, ambush advantage on them. And it looks like they actually have the higher ground. So... They have the higher ground. That means we're we're flubbled. So I'm hoping that they will come to me is what I'm hoping. So I am going to set this up in a honey pot for them to come on through and just have to try to get these heavy onagers. So we're gonna set the heavy onagers back here. Get them situated like so. And we want to have our defensive units for the heavy onager, so we're going to have like three of these. Put them here, and let's see how far... Oh man, I wish you'd let me stretch them so much wider. So the hoplites, I'm going to have them, you know, I'm going to have them here. And I'm going to have the other hoplites here. Yeah, I'm going to be like really defensive minded here. And the hoplites are going to be here. And then I'm going to have these. Wait, wait a second. I didn't group you. should have grouped you. All right, make sure you're grouped. There we go. You're grouped. There you're grouped. Now, I got my horses. Now, I want to be differently. I want to be selective with. Uh, okay, now, oh, get my archers here. Let me get my archers here, because my archers, you're going to be behind here. Stretched out. Oh, I got a nice stretch out for Yens. Yeah, I said Yens. That's old school for me. I don't know if anybody else ever grew up saying Yens, but I did. Okay, I'll put oh, archers stop. back here, and I'll put the flaming shots on. I always put the flaming shots on for the visuals alone. And that's what I'm here for, friends. And then I have, you know, I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to space these guys differently. I think I'm going to move these a little bit closer. A little. As you come on. I'm going to make it a little bit. No, no, come on, come on. All right. All right. Now let, now let me move these guys a little bit over. And then these guys, let's see if I can get these guys stretched out and you know, a little bit closer a purpose. I wish I could get you guys more stretched out. Really wish I could get you so much further stretched out. Let me see if there's like, if I put them in a line and then I stretch them, does that enable me? No, it doesn't. I really wish I could make these guys longer and I'm, 
I really want them just to be in guard mode. And my idea here is... I really do want them to just come to me. And I want to put you in guard mode. And I got my general up here. Put you no, you know what? I'm gonna put all of these guys because I think I need to have my horses like hoarded. And I'm gonna put you guys in the center here. I want you guys kind of bunched up. Kind of bunched up. And I'm gonna try to maneuver these guys more. So, oh, oh, I don't wanna do that. Come on, get you bunched up. Get you bunched up. Okay, bunched up. Yeah, Alright. Oh, you suck. You suck. That didn't do what I wanted. Alright. Alright, alright. So, with that in mind, I'm going to leave these guys here as well. I'm going to wait. I'm going to let them come to me. I am going to patiently wait. And let's see what happens. Our reinforcements have arrived. Who will I didn't realize we had reinforcements. Holy moly. Foes. Make ready. Okay, where are you? Where are you? This is a game changer for me. Let me just put you all in one group and uh, let me go see where you are at. Okay, so I'm going to ask you guys to just go ahead and just go ahead and get on up there. So you guys are just going to be like sacrifices, okay? I don't even care what happens to any of you. Just go and attack. Meanwhile, you guys, we're just going to patiently wait for you to come down to us. That's what's going to happen. I want to see what you do from their perspective. Let's let's take it from your perspective. All right. Oh, well, it's not their perspective, but hey, these guys are going in. I'm, I'm with it. Let's ride. I love these ride-ins. Let's go, boys. I don't know who's back there. Oh, I don't know. Did we already lose? See, this is why, you know, the horsies, man. Wow. Fucking vulgar mouth. Wow, that was rude. What are we doing? Listen, I don't know what you're doing, but I don't like it. I don't know what you're doing. Whoa. Okay. Let's go with you guys. Let's go in. Okay. What are you doing? Why do you keep doing this to me? Give me the ride in. Give me the battle. Oh, yeah. All right. It's just a muddle. It's just a muddle. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. These are sacrifices. Just sacrifices. I don't even view these as real troops. Just just go in. Just all of you. Just Swift go for it. Yeah, just, just go in. Yeah. And we dare you to come down here and try us. Because we don't even care. Just keep on going. Or just like, okay, boomer. Okay, boomer. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even care. Don't even care. Alrighty. Come on, just rush in. You know what? Just get on up here, you idiots. Get on up close. Super close. Super, super close. You know what? Go after this guy. Go up here. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Here we go. Go up here. There you go. Just, just, just wreak havoc. Just keep going in. Okay, so what's your game? What's your damage? Oh. You guys aren't, aren't in the mix? Oh, man. Oh, I'll put you in a group. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't mean to leave you out. Tell you what. Just go right here. 
And then when you get there, then I'm going to have you do stuff. But meanwhile, you guys, what you doing? You just like, go for it. Go for it. Go get them. Go in. There you go. There you go. Just, just, just punch him in the face. Just, just do it. Eventually, man, you guys are going to have to come off this hill. I'll tell you that. I'll tell you that. You're going to have to rush on down to us, and then we're just going to, just going to destroy you. And uh, by the way, we're not caring if they run away because eventually we'll, they'll be back in our, our good graces. We'll, we'll. We plan on restoring and, and redeeming as much of these people as we possibly can when it's over. Because these are our, our brothers, our sisters, our family, our friends. We're, we don't want to end up routing them. We would prefer if they just ran off and, and, uh, and we're okay with that. But meanwhile, we, we're going to kill them because we do that. And we just want them to run away. They just run away. Go ahead. Uh, we don't want you to go that. There you go. Yeah. Come on. I don't even know if we're our main force is even going to be a factor. I didn't even know we had reserves. That's wonderful. I'm so happy we had reserves. All right, come on. Come on, come on, come on, just, just, just run over them. Come on. All right, melee mode. Get him, get him. There you go, get him. Get him. Melee mode. Chase him off the field, that's fine. We're okay with them leaving. That's okay. Oh, why don't you leave? Come on. They won't leave. Sorry. I'm sorry, brothers and sisters. I'm sorry. Didn't want to have to do this. Gotta do it. The battle is turning in our favor. All right. Back, back on them. I mean, I don't know what to say, friends. It's horrible to do this to our own family, but what can we do? What can we do? Oh, you guys are just now getting into shape. Oh. All right, go ahead and fire. It's kind of bittersweet, you know? You know, we're winning, but, you know, you know, you, you know, just, just, just leave. You guys, you don't need to, you don't need this. Get, get broken and, and leave and we'll let you leave we will we will yeah because we're fighting our own family here you guys know that right so it's a little weird yeah it's a little 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 tough I'm not gonna lie to you it's a little difficult you know I thought that I if I just let him have Apollonia that would just I just take it back and no big deal but it really had had far more reaching ramifications than I had really realized. It's it's my humorism. Sometimes I have to remember. Even God mode has a, has its limitations, and sometimes I just forget myself. I just you know I'm just not a benevolent God all the time, and I apologize for that to no one because if I did, then they would doubt my awesomeness and my certainty. So I had people killed, and now nobody remembers it. So cool. Moving on what you do it's what you do for the people it, they can't be bothered by such things all right let's get on up there come on let's go we're all in melee mode by the way well these guys are but nobody's ever come down the hill let them run let them run if they run away but just make sure they run away keep going there you go oh those are the guys that and they won't leave. Yeah, God bless them. I mean, how did we hurt you so badly that you felt like that you would rather die than stay with us? I'm so hurt by this. It really hurts my feelings. I mean, why don't you just run off? Come on, guys. Just, just run off. Just don't do this. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to your family, to your, to your people. We, we all love you. 
run away and just live to fight another day with us. I'm glorious because we need you. We want you. Wait, what are you doing? Oh. Oh well, finish them off. Oh. Yeah. That'll be the end of him. And there, that's the end of that. It's all, it's just bitter, you know. You do these things. You know, I'm a little, little broken up. Broken up. These are our family that we're doing this tidbit we got to for the good of the whole. They rebelled. They, they, they thought that there should be choice. And we're like, no, no choice. Choice is bad. Human beings don't do well with choice. Trust me. And they didn't trust us. God bless them. They didn't trust us. There we go. There we go. All right. All right. Nice. Configured for death. I hate to do it. Oh, it's going to be ugly. Oh. Oh, it's a shame. That's a shame. I mean, oh, are they finally going to come down the hill? They have never come down the hill. We've never had anyone in sight. Yeah. I mean, we fire, but... I mean... The enemy huh. general is dead. The enemy general is dead. I mean, they've never. They never even came down. <laughs> Chair went back a little bit further than I thought it should. That's not going to help you. There you go. There we go. Go up the hill! Come on! Alright, get on up here. Come on. It's, it's going to be bad. If you ever get up there. Come on, you guys! I can't believe these guys are so slow when they're spawning. Come on. I mean, I never really even had to bring these guys. That, I mean, they never came down. I was hoping that these guys would go up and then maybe these guys would be like forced to go down. But that never happened. So it, it, it ruined the fun that I was going to have. And I apologize, you guys. I thought I was going to be able to get... Huh. Dingles. Get them. 
And then that's it. All right, all right, all right, all right. Yes. No, we don't want to continue. We want to end the battle. There we go. We don't. We don't want to save that. We want to. We're going to purge that from history. That never happened. We're going to deny that in exi existentiality from here into perpetuity. And so, well, I think uh, I think we're going to make sure that we don't have any more battles to fight. And and hey, whoever this guy Antaeus is. He's not in my faction, but you know I gotta give it. I I can't, I can't be shit. I can't be sweating him. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna release the captains. We gotta. Ready for further orders. Make haste, men. And there you go. I have to. I have to keep battle. it going though. Leave them alive. Oh, just twenty-seven of them. There you go. And there you go. I mean, what's up with that? I love these helmets. They're so cool. And we're gonna we're gonna release the captives again. All right, all right. I think that we are finally. Uh oh, no. Let me just keep you. Oh gosh, I'm sorry, my friend. We, we still got another faction. Oh gosh. And another faction. You know what, folks? We are going to deal with that in... Well, not in the next episode. Next episode, we are going to have the Battle of Rome. I think we need to take Rome right now. We need it for a number of reasons, but we're going to take Rome. And then after Rome, we're going to take Italy. And then after Italy, we got a lot of work to do, as you can see. We're not going to settle these factions anytime soon, but we do have the ability to put our guy in place now. We got Mo in place. Mo is ready. And we got ready for second orders. army ready. And we got our reserve. For battle. For battle. And we got our reserve one in the right place. So we are going to be able to do the battle for Rome in the next episode. So thank you for watching. This has been Frico Plays God Mode. Total War Rome 2, Epirus Faction, Episode 28. Uh, it was going to be the Battle of Rome. It turned out to be Part 10, putting down the Epirian Rebellion. And we're still not done. We still have some secessionists to deal with. But we're still going to take Rome. And it's going to help the morale of, of our whole empire that's why we're doing it see you in the next episode